be live. Hello, everybody, and welcome Hi. back to Stardew Valley. I'm joined by Mr. Uh, Godly Seafood. Here on the Cosby Farms, we like to add a little bit of extra uh, to our produce, so you can feel a little bit good after you eat your, your corn and your chicken. Fair. Then we come in and buck fuck you. What? No, we can't start the episode like that. No. Look, man, we have a brand to uphold. Also, I'm in. All right, let's see if I can hop in. Not yet. Yeah, what is it? Last time we got the bigger house. Uh... I don't remember what we were doing last episode. Oh, we were doing the fall episode, or the fall thing. The, yeah, the, the fall festival, whatever. Festival, yeah. that's the word. Yeah. Oh, fuck me. But yeah, you got corn to grow. Is it? Um, I'm pretty sure I'm max farming already. Nice. No, well, I mean... Or not. Yeah. You're, you're probably already max, but because you're the one who has to end it off, you're the one who has to deal with it. I'm just kidding. Honestly, we can start ripping this stuff up or whatnot. Uh, well, I gotta put some stuff up real quick. Yeah, that's so right. It's good to have money. We're not gonna be farming much in, in the winter, so we're not gonna be getting that farming. This is true. So it would be smart to do it now. Let's see. I don't know what's supposed to go the in idea here. For today's episode is getting the greenhouse and finishing off the winter. Or finishing off fall going into the winter. We'll see how that goes. Right. Man, I was playing on Stardew Valley the other day on my main account and I was like, I'm gonna go kill some bugs for the hell of it. On this this world, I got like three fucking rice things and not a single ancient seed. And then from my my other guy who's already got everything I need, they, they decided to drop me a fucking rice seed for no reason. It's like, why? Why couldn't you just give me an ancient seed on the world that we need it? Um, what is it? Looking at three... We need large goat milk and wool, which we can get as soon as the goat starts producing it. Are there sheep in the game? Uh, no. Last time, so yeah. Wool goat comes from the goat. That makes no sense, but yeah. Well, goats have wool. They... Or fleece, or whatever it's called. Forts. Done. They got hair. How you think they keep their nuts warm? They don't. That's just a swag. I see that fucking chicken escaping in the background. Get your ass over here. What about here. the fucking cow that's escaping into my car? Is that where the fourth one went? I was looking you know, for him. <laughs> bro's up here, bro. He's trying to eat some corn. He's sick and tired of me. He gave me iridium quality milk. I've never seen that from like any of my cows. Well, Although at some point I stuck, I just stopped like caring for them and was basically like, you know what? I'll just get regular cheese from you guys. I want to get an auto petter, but that's like some crazy bullshit thing. Like with RNG that you can't really get. What does that even mean? So an auto petter is made by Joja, you know, the Joja Corporation. Okay. And in order to get the auto petter, you have to buy everything, which would take away from our experience from, you know, enjoying the game first time around, or you need to. Uh, find it in a, in a random chest in a in the skull caverns but it's like a small percent chance and the skull caverns it's like once you're going down there it's typically only going to be like guaranteed on floors 100 200 300 that you get a chest 
and you would be spending a ton of resources just to see if you even get one. So it's like not worth getting. Uh, like trying to get. Plus all the stuff that you get in between going up and down throughout the the skull caverns. It's like you kind of want to use most of that shit for stuff. Fair. Yeah, so it's like it'd be really cool to get one, but it's technically just too difficult to deal with. And the difficulty of getting it just makes it either not worth it or worth it if you're doing a specific playthrough. Yeah, like, like after you've enjoyed playing like the normal way and stuff like that once or twice, it's not a bad idea to just say, you know what, fuck it, let's go dick around with the Jojo experience. Dark dog house, what the fuck? That's weird. So, does Stardew Valley have an end? I mean, you, there, you can reach perfection, which is basically just a title of, hey, you've 100%ed things in a certain way. But, like, realistically, after you do all the main stuff, it's like, hey, now you get to, like, after you build the community center and you do the stuff on uh, Ginger Island and stuff like that, it's like, well, now you just kind of do your own thing. They're adding... You know, they constantly add stuff, like updates and stuff like that, which they just recently did a bunch of up updates and whatnot. But uh, for the most part, it's just kind of like, once we get the greenhouse and finish like 100% the community center, and we, you know, and then go and do some stuff at, you know, Ginger Island, stuff like that, and Skull Caverns get us to where it's... Like, there's definitely going to be a stopping point, but there's not a point where it's like, oh, okay, I have done absolutely everything that the game required of me through the main story, and now the game is over. Like, there are some things that you can do afterwards. Like, if you haven't caught any fish before the end of the game, then obviously you can go do that. But, like, I'd say a good stopping point is whenever you're just getting bored. Because apparently, like towards the end game, you can just start making massive amounts of money to where it doesn't even matter. So, yeah. Okay. Because, like, if we ever need, like, iron or stuff like that, chances are we'll go to the Skull Caverns or to the mines, but it's not going to be, like, getting to uh, floor 120 of the mines all over again, you know? large egg there and yeah now we just need wool i forgot to shear the sheep or the goat whatever it is but yeah if there's ever a point where you're just like getting bored and you don't want to do anything anymore we can just get which from what i've been told there's actually quite a bit of content I've mostly stayed, or stayed around, like, just doing shit on the farm or, uh, you know, getting my iridium tools and whatnot. And setting up a, uh, what is it, pretty, pretty much like having my farm automated with iridium sprinklers. But I haven't really gone towards the end game, you know? All right, let's see what is in my inventory. I have two bombs, my weapons, a scythe, and a cake. And it's Sunday, so. Oh, the the trader guy is gonna be over there. Glazed yams. That sounds like a very sexual term. What, glazed yams? Yeah. No, I'd say I glaze your yams, so that's pretty gay. That's exactly where I'm at. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, okay, I will go check the community place. 
the community board to see if there's anything there and then I think I will cut back when we're actually doing something fun again well not fun but more interesting to watch than me just watering plants unless y'all find that entertaining in which case let me know uh... do a 12 hour ASMR of you watering plants I'm going to fucking cry what? tears Ryan tears about to do that. <laughs> Both of these are one days. I can't do this today. Both of the, re the requests are impossible. Kill issue. Well, it is, but I didn't go there in the morning. Oh, it's Robin's birthday. Oh, fuck Robin. Yo, Robin, have this lobster bisque. Then Ryan may or may not have uh, got what? What? Did you just take my lobster bisque? No, I gave her my lobster bisque. You lying slut! Don't lie to no, me. No, go look in your chest, you bitch. Uh, oh no, I, I'm not actually willing to go look and verify. I'm just gonna assume that you did it. All right, well then I'll just steal your lobster bisque in the chest. So you did steal my lobster bisque. I'm about to. Let me get up there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, we need... Oh, fuck. I think he just closed. God damn it. Who? The fucking trader dude. I was gonna... Man, I could have bought us honey. And we could have gotten this thing from the bear over here, but... I didn't think about it too hard. Also, right. we should have honey at some point. Or B hives are just like not going. Alright, well, people, you guys will be back when y'all are back. Oh. Uh, you an auto grabber? Yeah. Yeah, that one's not important. Well, I mean, that, that just like helps us not have to worry about the eggs cluttering or milking the cows specifically. Oh. Huh. Yeah, it's not the auto petter. The auto petter is like if you if you were able to if, if you were able to get an auto petter and an auto grabber then you would never have to deal with your pets again or your animals again you just walk in pick everything up and their happiness should stay the same fuck i left the cow door open oh what is this oh it's an eggplant um yeah apparently they just changed it to where you have to like close your animals barn doors now or their friendship will start going down. Is it because it's cold in there now? Well, I mean, it hasn't. It was. It was not like that in the in vanilla. Well, it's like still vanilla. It, it's been years since that's been an addressable issue in the community, from what I hear. Yeah, and years after, when everyone has accepted the fact, now they're changing. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. That's why people were so confused with Helldiver. What happened with Helldivers? They are fixing problems that the community actually cares about on time. That's bullshit. That's what I'm saying. Gosh, I don't. I don't bullshit. believe you. <laughs> Developers fixing issues on time? No fucking way. That's what I'm saying. Also, I love Helldiver uh, devs. It, Helldiver seems like a really interesting thing. I just don't have the ability to check it out yet. I can't run it. There's no way the the. The little hand box you gave me to run Helldivers. I would handle it. Yeah. 100%. But, um, yeah, the reason people love Helldiver devs is because the, the community is bitching about the hardest difficulty of the game being very hard. And the devs straight up said, skill issue, and that's it. Fucking nice. Yeah, it was like, amazing. I right, mean, people... we just have any coal to produce. We will Bread come back when produce. something well, else what the interesting happens. What the fuck does that mean? What does what mean? I know for a fact this motherfucker is supposed to produce wool. I'm telling you, bro, sheep produce wool, not goats. Did I get a sheep instead of a goat? Is that a you thing? Can... I need to go to Marnie's real quick and lay some pipe. 
I swear to God, if I was right, I'm gonna be very surprised and depressed. I thought it was a goat. I thought there were like cows, goats, and then pigs. Sheep give wool. Goats give goat cheese. Goats, goats can give wool too. Goats do not give wool. Either way, we should be able to deal with it before winter. And she's not working today. God damn it. Oh, I'm going to cry. Tears, Ryan. Tears. What? What do you mean what? The farm. Why? What about the farm? It takes so long. Can I get a don't water worry. hose attached to my watering can so I don't have to run? <laughs> don't worry, we'll have sprinklers next year. Honestly, oh, we could probably, with the amount of progress we're making, we could probably just skip to iridium sprinklers. Instead of... Like, uh, high quality sprinklers. So there's sprinklers, which are dog shit. High quality sprinklers, which are, you know, what you'd want to use in this situation. But then there's iridium sprinklers, which I'm pretty sure one of us will be able to make at some point in time in the near future. And so once we get that, like, we could just say, fuck it, and start getting iridium from the Skull Caverns. Because we're, I would imagine we're pretty close to getting the bus if we haven't done so already. No, because we haven't done any of the vault stuff. Yeah, but that that comes like super easy. That's just money. And right oh, now yeah. our finances are just tied up. Like we could probably, after this next harvest, just finish off the, the bus stuff. My main issue is we're not going to have a source of income in the winter. Uh, the farm. We'll have the greenhouse. In which, yeah. which case, actually, thinking about it, we might want to get uh, sprinklers just for the, the inside of there. Sorry, I'm cutting down all of our hay. It's grown an unreasonably unmanageable size. Well, I literally just told the people I'm cutting so they don't have to watch me garden, and I've just showed them me gardening. So. Nice. Fuck you guys, I'll be back later. <laughs> Alright. Bounty board. Seven days for prismatic jelly. Hell no. There's no way. I'm putting on a little promotion just for fun. If anyone can collect 1,000 pieces of wood in a week, they'll earn a reward and you keep the wood. Yes. We could buy that. No, she wants us to cut it down. She doesn't Don't touch my trees. Wood. We need those. I'm, I'm fucking your trees, I'm sorry. No, I mean, we we legitimately need that for in-game stuff. It's not worth it. What? Why not? The, the sap. We need a lot of sap. Which, let me see how many tappers we can make. Okay, then I'll clear all the trees outside. I don't know that I have the recipe for tappers yet. I think that's a foraging thing, maybe. You, oh, can right. you make tappers? What do they look like? Uh, it's like a little. How do I describe? Oh wait, no, here it is. Uh, I need a bunch. I need a lot yeah, more copper tappers. than we currently got. So. Uh, where is my? Axe? Where is your axe? My axe? Yeah, give me. Uh, axe. it's over here if you want it. Where's oh, there you go. getting this copper done? Put it in here. Just don't touch any of the trees to the left or the north of us in this area. Don't, but if you need wood, to the right and bottom. We don't have any. It's in there. It's in that chest I was in. Right. I don't know. It's free money. Yeah, but a thousand thousand woods a lot. Yeah, I'm, I'm, is tree cutting a skill? Uh, that will actually level up your foraging, and yeah. there's a lot of trees down here. Throw that away. Then 
tappers. I will make as many tappers as we can. Do do the stumps count as well, or no? Uh, no, just the top of the trees. But we might as well clear those out. I mean, do we have to though? Fine, I'll do them. That's more wood anyway. Well, honestly, it should not take that long. I need a pickaxe or something. Move, you stupid fucking cat. I'm like, why is everything so close to... I got moss. Oh, this is what you were talking about. Yeah, it grows on the trees randomly. Yeah, I see it. Does it have any actual value? Uh, yeah, we should be able to make stuff with it. I'm just not sure what yet. Okay. And then these will go here. Um. This tree is not supposed to be here. We got some new ideas you're gonna sleep on. You should sleep on. Like, what does that mean? Bro, better get the fucking brain engine going. I'm assuming that has to be new update. Cause I don't, I don't remember that being a thing pre update. Yeah, yeah, it's definitely an update thing. I'm just not sure what it's for. Yeah. How do I have a fucking eggplant? Let's see. I'll collect it up tomorrow after gardening. I'll, I'll focus on just. Oh shit. Trees then. But for some reason we can't get it till tomorrow because Marnie's a stupid fucking slut who wants to walk in everywhere else except where she's needed. Alright, people watching. Uh, we have discovered there are in fact sheep. Also, Linus is gay. Got him. Guy, why is he peeking at me in, in the spa, man? Hopefully he's still there so y'all can see it. That man's a pervert. pervert. I don't know if we can you. even get a duck right now. Let's see, is he still there? I, look at him! Look at him! He's looking at you. As soon as I came out, he started running away from me. Come back here. What do you mean no. I'm minding my own business? Shut your lying ass up. <laughs> Like, I swear, I only saw one ball. One It's a medical <laughs> condition, okay? <laughs> Whoa. Hey, look, I walked, I, I walked 10,000 paces. Dude, I see his ass walking away from the scene of the crime. <laughs> do, you, do you also see him? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. All right, yeah. now to go into the mines. We need a bunch of yeah, shit. Yeah, Ryan's getting a shit ton of copper. I'm still dealing with this. Um... After, on what day is it? The 24th. So basically tomorrow we're going to have a big boy harvest for this area. All the stuff that isn't harvested, we're just going to get rid of. I'm just not going to deal with it. Because it's not going to be regrown in time. Or, no, no, I, I will on the 24th, on the 25th, after I harvest everything, I won't do it. So there would be no point. And I will now go back down to uh, chopping trees. And I'll see you guys after that. Oh. Here, follow me. Why am I following you? I'm gonna go in this this chest right here and grab the uh, the honey and then follow me. And it's a Friday, so the extra you merchant will be there. Just one. Just one. Oh, we had two? Yeah, we had two. Damn. We could have done this a lot sooner. Alright, well, since you guys last saw, we um, upgraded the barn. We got a Shep, I think. I already know that. Though. Am I going down and then over? To the Enchanted Forest. 
And then also we cut down a lot of trees. Well, I cut down a lot of trees. Hey, do we need a fish called the Dorado? Sure. It's a thousand gold though. Fish. We might. I don't know. All uh, right. Anyway, yeah, just anyway. go in there and you should get a cutscene. Did it not? No. Go? Maybe it's like after the first year? I don't know. Where's, That's where's weird. The bear? I don't know. Usually it's supposed to bring us. You got the fucking honey. What the... Yeah. Yeah, I got Maybe the honey. I don't, I don't know what he wants. Maybe we need it out in our inventories when we're doing this? Maybe. Hold up. You stay out of here. No. Well, okay. Well, yeah. yeah never mind. Uh, we did that. Let's see. What do we get? We got 2,500 gold for that. Not only that, plus we should have gotten tickets at the bounty board. Oh. Bang. Oh, shit. We got like 5,000 gold from that total. That's awesome. Yep. And I got an Omni Geode. Let's go. Can you get a chef now? Oh, we're about to get a ship. We haven't gotten it yet. Bro, we upgraded the barn. 8,000 gold for fucking sheep. That's fine. Why am I going this way? There's the least off of that. There, we have a prize ticket. Go to. Cool, we have a sheep. It'll take a few days till we can get wool, but it's there. We got 15 mixed flower seeds, whatever that means. Mixed flower seed? We can probably use that at some point. You should also be able to grab that. Now we go back to farming. Was it just one prize ticket? Yep. It's one per bounty. See if there's a bounty right. that you want, or you think we can do. I forgot to check them. Ooh. Oh, mail. I really shouldn't complete my long from press. As an added bonus, I've included the blueprints for a new type of chest. Enjoy. Ooh, where'd you get that? We can make stone chests. Let's go. I don't know what the value is on that. Notice a chill in the air. It just could be a winter crochet. It could be a tingle of the dark specter. There's a festival at 10 p.m. today. Yeah. I might go to it. And I'll see you guys there. You think it's going to be fun? Uh, I already know what it is. The Halloween festival. Oh, is it? Yeah. We don't really right. do much. We look at the little skeletons. They got trapped here. Uh, what is this? What does he sell? Oh, yeah. There's the maze over here. What happens if you collect all the, the rare crows? You get a even better rare crow. Is that it? Yeah, but it, it does actually function better. You can't see it, but each scarecrow has a radius, and it's a large radius. But the the mega, like the the rare crow that you unlock has, like the biggest radius. So do we actually want to get it, or to grab the greenhouse? It doesn't matter. Uh, how much money we got? Like it's like five grand. It's like. It's not worth it unless it's you just want to collect it. You you can grab it if you want. I'll be over here by the maze whenever you're ready. Does, do we have to do the maze? I uh, probably want to. Alright. Did you see the little skeletons in the fighting pit? I did, I did. Where's the maze? You said up? Yeah. My god, look at them hands. Does that happen? No, they just jerk you off. Nice. 
Or do you not know the path of the maze? Huh? I do. Why did you go all the way up? Why didn't you? I did. And that's the end. You're lying. It's the end, dude. It came the wrong way. I don't, I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> you can just, like, see my fucking light switch. You have to, like, walk out of the mine. Like up to the left, or yeah, up to the right, and then, then kind of down once you get towards the end. And then yeah, the golden pumpkin. The golden pumpkin. Well, that's it. We, do we not go to the middle? What What do you mean? This is. What do you mean the middle? This part, the fountain tomorrow. We, oh, we came walked that past way. there to get to here. Yeah, 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 yeah. All these stupid oh, fucks right. walking around, they don't know where the end is. Oh, yeah, also, if you look like at the very top, I don't know if you can see it from here. Uh, wait, let's go back. You can see the guild master and uh, fucking Linus just chilling way back there. And they technically have dialogue, like you can walk up and go talk, or if you can get out of bounds, you can walk up and go talk to them, and they'll have like little specialized dialogue. Uh, you don't. What, that, then what's the... Then it's just a neat little, neat little thing. Did you just... That's fine. What? We got wait, we don't even need to get out, we just go around the right. Oh shit, how do we get to the right? Okay, yeah, okay. Makes sense. Anything else we can do? Or is that it? Nope. Nope, that's it. And surprise! Oh wow, it ends at twelve. I was gonna say, maybe it ends at like ten, like the last time, but nope. All right, you ready for the last day? The last day. Oh. oh. God, I'm tired. <laughs> And there's your corn. Yeah. Same lost the corn. Yeah, they only come to our channel so they can watch you grab corn. It's only for my corn videos. No, nothing. What'd you say? Oh, you didn't even hear it? No. Horrible. What did you say? I said they're only here for my porn videos. Yep. Uh, ever since that one meme day, like several years ago, Cornhub.com has been up in the air for grabs. Cornhub, up until like four years ago, was up. It was at an actual like, farmer market, like farmer's market. Like, yeah. genuinely, it, it was a farmer's market, and then I think the person wanted to, like, sell their domain, like, click the name, and then uh, no one actually bought it. It was way, priced way too high. Probably. I think the person wanted, like, 225k for the name. Hey, let's go. The, the mushrooms are available. Why can I not? Oh, something was in the way. Doing 
We got a red mushroom. Nice, I think. Yeah. And a salmon berry. Nice. I'm assuming you got that from the cave. Yep. Oh, fuck. I'll go deal with the animals. Alright. Well, since it's later the last day and all this will in fact die tomorrow, I'll have to take care of anything. Nope. So my day is once again free. Did you see the, uh, the name of the sheep? No, I have not yet. You learned how to make artichoke dip. Where is the chef at? What is your name, chef? Why? <laughs> it's fat nut pony dog. You know why I named him that? Why? <laughs> because of his fat fucking nuts. Mm -hmm. Uh, let's see. Um, where's my other rare scarecrow? There it is. Now we have two Ooh. out of eight. I'm gonna buy this. I'm gonna buy a couple of these. What are you buying? Uh, things from the guide. This is gonna be super useful when we go to the Skull Caverns. What guy? The guy. The, the, the merchant guy? The travel merchant? Yeah. They're lucky lunches. They give us plus three luck, and if we go go to the Skull Caverns on a luck, like a really good luck day, we uh, what is it? We'll just have e an easier time getting through the mines, whilst also doing shit. So I'm gonna save right, these. Yeah. I need to buy two things from you, okay? I need to buy one of these. There's a fairy seed. Who cares? You collected all the corn, yeah? Yeah. Just gonna go ahead and get rid of this. It doesn't have my other seeds. Hmm. This is really upsetting. What seed? Uh, palms. At least we have an amp. Uh, at least we have an amaranth seed. What's an amaranth? It's purple wheat. The one to the left just kind of by itself. Do I have a cauliflower seed, which is nice? thing about that sheep is we don't even have to wait for it to start liking us it just has to be adult for us to harvest it it'll only take like four to six days 
Total. Area? Uh, I'm just clearing it out just in case we want to move stuff. Uh. Because, right. like, we can move the greenhouse and our farm and the animals and shit. Fair. I mean, all this stuff is going to shrivel up and die and then go the next day anyway, isn't it? Like, eventually? Yeah, but we, we still have to scythe that. I'm just, like, just kind of getting rid of it just because there's nothing I really want to do. We can learn how to make a moss soup. It takes 20 moss. I feel like it's too expensive. Yeah. Me too. How big is the greenhouse? Uh, it's not really that big on the inside, but I mean, it's something. Like... The main benefits are we are t the trees, like fruit trees that we have, can grow year round without you know being shit on by the winter. Uh, we can grow plants in the winter. So yeah, I see. Also, these two things were just straight up dead. Uh, you never know. No, they can bounce back. They did not. They still got time. I literally watered them an entire fucking month for no reason. Well, now we have to go to the underworld to get their souls back. Thank nice. you. Thank you for creating excess problems for us. Yes. <laughs> Could you fucking imagine? Oh, that's that's a corn. Like you accidentally kill your roommate's house plant, and then it's like, well, it's gonna casually go to the underworld and retrieve its dead soul. Yes, that is what we must do. Once they made the fucking day cycle from twenty-eight to thirty. And we did this, and we lost the harvest. Well, round two of the harvest. That'd be crazy. That'd be depressing. Cow, fuck off and go home. I'm telling you, it's like, if you don't put a fucking uh, wall up, they just, like, they'll travel. Are you going to? No. Not unless we actually, like, get serious with animals and get pigs and shit. I thought we were going to get pigs and shit. Okay. I thought I was, like, one of the things... I don't know, that'll be... Uh, that'll take a minute, because pigs, pigs are hella expensive. More than 6k? But, like, 16k, I think, or uh, something like that. But they, like, once you get a ton of them, you just start raking in money. Like, at least. Depending on your perks, if you have, you know, double drops from foraging and then iridium level foraging, guaranteed, drop? you can get, like, 75,000 gold per day. From what? Well, they, drop, they drop truffles. Oh. Yeah, so I'd say you maybe average 50k per day if uh, if you happen to just, like, stay on top of it or, you know, depending on if you miss a day. 
Well, you really stopped like midway through. Yeah, I was at one energy. Skill issue. Uh, that is literally not a skill issue. <laughs> Be better. Get more health. Health wouldn't do anything. Not my, not my problem, dog. Also, this was a U project that I decided to help out with. And you couldn't even help me finish. Terrible. Of course I'm not going to help you finish. You do that on your own. Weird. No, I need an extra pair of hands, dog. No, you're good. Cool. All right. Well, I will catch you later. Uh, let's see what we get. Well, first let's go into the first night. I don't know about that. We'll start off like on winters. Yeah, well, like I actually want to like, see what winter looks like. And then we're going to restart the day next time we come. Oh yeah, there's an annoying ass cutscene, by the way. Oh or maybe not, maybe eyes. it's like the fourth day. Yep, it's all... Oh, it's so fucking bright. Yep. <laughs> Interestingly enough, our, uh, our tappers still produce during the winter. That makes sense. Doesn't. Do. Cool. Right, I'm gonna jump off. I will catch you later. For the people watching, I'll see you guys in the next episode. Peace.